so this is the setup of a hypothetical political science class. Mm -hmm. Nobody named Tim Fenn ever took such a class. Mm. Uh, this is completely fictional. The the characters represented in this in this film are works of fiction. Uh, so there was this fellow who was a six of hearts, a mm. lowly little six of hearts. Mm. Uh, and he was in such a class as political science. This human being, this lowly human being, sat here on the second day because he missed the first day because he slept in. Mm -hmm. uh, and he, he woke up at um, 8.40 and the class started at 8. And that it takes about the worst. half an hour to get there. Yes, uh, yes, depending on traffic. Yes. yes. And so then the second day, then he was only 20 minutes late. So, Only 20. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good start, good start. Yeah, yeah. And there were some some, some average commoners, so civilians right there. Take your time. Uh, hmm. Oh, okay. This is the teacher. Very well educated, hence the ace of spades uh, mm. thing. Uh, and then somebody right here... Uh, Way on the other end of the class. Mm. Also pretty smart, but a man. Uh, and <sighs> who would later turn out to be this person's competition. And then... <sighs> the key player in this scenario. Yes. The first day, then my... Or this person's teacher uh, mm. asked uh, to name... Asked the students to name uh, various political positions, various political offices, and I, and, and this person, I, I don't know why I keep on saying I, because yes. I am not this person at all, uh -huh. you know, this person answered uh, a bunch of questions, mm. uh, because this person likes studying politics, because this person is afraid of the power that politicians have over mm. this person, therefore he, he studies them mm. to know how to uh, resist them and be uh, able to to work around them and such. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, and then uh, the professor had. I just I just knocked people. Hey. Uh, the professor had people go into groups, and I happened to be grouped with with such a person. So I'll just say I, but <laughs> but I is a code word for this person. So I, the six of <laughs> hearts was paired up with uh, this person and mm. this human. We, we were supposed to name different political positions in this group mm. and then write them down um, and then also write down each other's names on each sheet of paper that we wrote it down on. Yeah, I named a lot of political positions uh, and then mm. they all wrote them down and we asked each other each other's names to write them mm. down. Interesting. I just remembered this man was actually in our group. Okay. Shockingly, what it was, it was what? just yeah. Okay, this eight. Notice, <sighs> I am a six. This is an eight. Interesting. Interesting. He was very intelligent. He wow. knew. Don't 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 knock yourself down like that. That's just. Well, 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 it's, just you can be a ten. You can be a ten. Ten of hearts, okay, if this, you want yeah, to. This sounds like a Disney movie or something. Okay. okay yes. This you can be whatever you want to. This isn't a Disney movie. This is real life. <sighs> Interesting. You can't reach. For this is a this is a DC production. You can't really high five this guy. Interesting. It's, it's <sighs> exactly. This is Joker. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Interesting. Even though that's a terrible movie. <sighs> what a good character study, though. Great character true, study. True. This, this is a marriage story. Ah, interesting. <laughs> interesting. One of my favorite movies of last year. <sighs> so, this guy he knew everything about J. Edgar Hoover and all of this, and he he was a smart guy. Uh, and if I might add, uh, mm. he was the kind of guy who ladies would, I'm sure, find attractive. Mm. Uh, un unfortunately for me. Oh, and, and and oh, okay, interesting, interesting. Yeah. Um, so we wrote down each other's names and everything, and then this this punk went back to where he belonged, right back here. Oh, I, I wish he had never yes. left here. You know. Oh. Oh. Uh, he but went back to where he went. He, back to he, his country. Yes. 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 I, I felt like telling him, go back to your country. Yes. Go back to Italy or yes. wherever. Yes. You, you even start to ponder if if he was even a legal citizen. Exactly. Yes. I became Donald Trump in that moment. Yes. And I, yes. I felt like building a wall. Ah, perfect. Or or right here. Ah, that would so be a, that would actually be uh, quite a good wall. It would be. 
Yes. It would be a very good wall. So <laughs> she, the professor asked us to name them uh, after we had already written them down. Hmm. And then she named one of the positions that I had said in the group. And then afterwards, as we were all shuffling out of class, <sighs> getting our backpacks and everything, she said to me, uh, sorry, I stole your thing or something like that. And then I said, that's okay. And then she said, you seem to know your stuff. And, and, and I was ah. at, in that moment, I was just astonished and overjoyed that I was engaged in this conversation that this person had started mm. and that she was mm. saying these things about me. And, uh, I was engaged in the conversation and I was almost engaged to be married. To her. Ah, and if, if you, if you had continued that conversation even deeper, do you feel like you would be a married man today? I, I do feel that I would be a married man today. Ah, uh, interesting. Yeah. Interesting. So that I, I continued the conversation even after we walked out and as hmm. we were walking away hmm. and I introduced myself. Uh, and I told her that I know so much, or, you know, hypothetically, of course, ah, of course. that I know so much about politi uh, politics because I... And hate, pollen. Yes, because I have allergies. That's what I know about <laughs> it. But I know so much about... So so I actually, I know about pollen and about politicians for the same reasons, which is that I hate both of those things. Ah, interesting. Uh, so, so I told her that politicians have a lot of power. And yes. that it's important to know so that we can hold them responsible for their power. Yes. Unlike Johnny, who is not responsible, responsible for what the boys do to Tim Day. Yes. So, uh, and that was the end of the conversation. And I just wow. introduced myself. And then we parted ways. And she went into the AC, the academic <sighs> building. And I had to go to work, unfortunately. <sighs> and to this day, after that, and all for a long time, to this day, I still wish that I had offered to walk her to class or something like that or asked her what she was doing after and asked her if she wanted to go get coffee or something like that. And then I could tell her more about how terrible the government is and she would be so impressed with my knowledge of how terrible the government is. Interesting. Uh, but I did not do that because I was is, a coward, hmm, hmm. as I said in the other video. Is, is this the same person who you opened the door to? When? Uh, you told me a while back that there was this person. I did open the door for her, oh, which is Act 2. 